Hello, hello everybody. The Blue Fox here. Today we're going to be taking a look at a PlayStation 5 game called Saga of Sins. I don't know too much about this game, but uh, we're going to just jump right into it and see uh, see what we can discover. Um, it looks... I would expect this to be like an RPG. Published by Just For Games, financially supported by the FFF Bayern and BMWK of the German Bundestag. Never heard of any of those. Um, start settings or credits. Let's check out the settings really quick. We just have audio, graphics, and language. All right, fairly simple. Um, let's start a new game. We're gonna go on normal mode. This game automatically saves at certain points. Please do not turn off the game or power supply when you see this icon. Maybe it's not an RPG. I mean, it looked dark. It gave me that vibe. Upon the world. Sin has corrupted the people of this land. And in their despair... <laughs> Look at these stained glass pictures. Beliefs and wicked deeds. Is that a man about to punch another man? <laughs> and pilgrimages to sacred territories have done little to abate the spread of such vices. A brave cleric has returned from one such crusade to our home village of Sinwell. This village has been stricken by the plague. The plague, the, the Black, Black Death. Death. Ooh. Born from the sins of its people. Um, I thought it was if spread by rats. Well is to be pulled back from the precipice of hell, this pestilence must be purged. I mean, it, it had to do with Whatever poor hygiene. The price may be. Right? The Black Death? It was uh, spread by poor hygiene and, and rats? Or rather, like, the ticks on rats. Lupo, you're still here. You got old, my friend. This game is like a stained glass picture. <laughs> or a stained glass window. Are they not feeding you? Here. This is all that's left of my supper. The rumors are true, then. Disease has found Sinwell. It's been a long journey back from the Holy Land. I longed eagerly for the day of my return, but... This is not the home I once knew. I wonder if Master Ulrich is still here. Pretty good voice acting. Uh, hey, I got control of my character. All right. So, circle is sprint, square is sprint triangle is sprint now <laughs> triangle and x don't appear to do anything at the moment r1 l1 r2 l2 clicking the sticks okay so it appears that the only thing i can do right now is sprint master ulrich it is good to see you again cecile you've arrived not it's not cecil it's cecile okay apologies master the holy wars have left me worse for wear, and traveling no longer comes easily. How are you expecting me? I received word your campaign has ended. I anticipated your return would soon follow. We are blessed to have you back, Cecile. After all this time, I sense change in your eyes. You have learned much in your time away. I learned to appreciate peace. I hoped to find it here, but word of the disease that plagues Sinwell reached me before I reached you. By now you're well aware it is not always in distant lands that our greatest enemies lurk. It is true. A grave malady afflicts Sinwell, and I fear more will be lost to it. But we will discuss further in the morning. I have arranged chambers for you. The night is dark, and you must rest. The people of Sinwell will need you, though they may not yet know it. Rest well, and Cecile, I would ask you to focus on your duties. Don't waste time on that dog. 
What? That dog is amazing. Whoa, the edges of the screen. I just noticed all around the edges of the screen, there's this cracked effect. It took me a little by, like, by surprise. You know what? Just to spite him, I'm going back to that dog. Oh, I can't interact with it. Well, so what? I'm going to dance around the dog. All right. seems to weigh heavy on Master Ulrich, but I feel something greater troubles him. Heavens, a proper bed. I swear, I haven't slept in anything but cold, hard ground in months. Embrace what comes, seeker of serenity. Do what you believe. Do what you must. Whoa. Above all, question the path set before you. <laughs> it's like Nosferatu faces coming at me. stranger than my usual dreams the sun is out master Ulrich will be waiting I best not keep him and the dragon and his angels fought back but he was not strong enough and the great dragon was rolled down that ancient serpent okay whoa Somebody got drunk. Whoa, all of the stained glass windows have been busted up. Were they like that before? I trust your rest was uninterrupted. Mostly. My dreams have been unsettling of late be on guard dreams have often revealed many marvels to me but the messenger was not always divine master Ulrich I wish we had the time to talk of your experiences in the crusade Cecil there is much I would like to know of your journey in the holy lands but we must act on this plague with haste agreed my stories can wait the Black Death does not only affect Sinwell. Surrounding settlements have suffered too. We must bring an end to this affliction. For the sake of our town's fall, we must stop it from spreading further. You have seen much on your pilgrimage, Cecile. You have witnessed firsthand the evil that sin has brought upon the world. It is sin that has brought this plague upon this village. And it is only by purging sin that your home can be safe. What would you have me do? You must free our people from the seven deadly sins. Hmm. It is the only way. But how would I even begin doing that? Not all may be willing to render confession, or even desire to repent. You are right. The sacrament of penance will not suffice. That is why you must kill them. <laughs> no. Sinwell is too far gone for the conventional ways have any meaningful effect murder them all take this glass fragment repair the stained glass in our chapel window I will explain why in due course it's a puppy a werewolf fearsome creature I remember seeing this as a child and recall it haunting several of my nightmares. Why would Master Ulrich need this repaired? Uh... 
the werewolf's icon graces our chapel once more. Though I am not sure how this helps us. Last night's festival revealed gluttony holds some of our people in a tight clutch. It was a festival, though. You saw plainly that Braum has imbibed far too much. I believe he depleted our last supply of the communion wine. <laughs> we must set an example and defeat the demons within the center. You must enter his mind, Cecile, and cast out his sin. Enter his mind? How is that possible? There are sacred mysteries and sacraments well beyond what even the wisest scholars are aware of. That's uh I will show you a little how to sus. enter their minds. But beware. Anyone invading another's mind will appear as an hostile entity. I don't think you use an in that sentence. An hostile? I think it would be a hostile. The sinner's mind will see you. That is why you asked me to repair the stained glass window? Precisely. In the villagers' minds, you will manifest as the monsters they see in our chapel stained glass. And they will fight back any way they can. How did it come to this, Master Ulrich? This village was once a sanctuary for good, faithful people. I grew complacent over the years, and all kinds of vices invited themselves here. We must excise these sins from our people, Cecile. The method may not be gentle, but it is necessary. Once you have cleansed the chapel grounds of all sinners, return to me. I understand. I will do what I can. Ah, werewolf unlocked. The first window reassembled and unlocked according, uh, the according creature. The werewolf, its furious triple shot, has long range and fast frequency. Howl at the moon and produce sound at a frequency that can shatter cracked glass to reveal hidden secrets. Keep the attack button pressed while standing still. Like any demonic creature, the werewolf features a double jump. Oh, as we all know, like any demonic creature. All right. Defeat the enemies to fill up your dash meter and then lock up power dash. Pew pew. Crouching shot. <laughs> oh, monies. Oh, I see. I'm looking on the background. Power dash! Congratulations, you killed four enemies and filled up your dash meter. Now it's time to release a power dash. Devizin can kill multiple enemies at once. It can be performed in eight directions while on the ground or in midair by pressing L2 or R2. The goal is to kill as many enemies as possible with a single power dash and reward you with double the amount of gold. Alright, we got one, two. Five. Wait, what? Oh. Okay, so I hit the table. A dash dub instantly finishes. Okay, so you're gonna. Alright. Remember, if you kill enemies with power dash, you get double the amount of gold. Okay. Sinful. <laughs> Sinful. <laughs> So that's life. Okay, you don't dash very far. Let me go back and get a new a new dash. Because I can oh I can't. <laughs> because I can. <laughs>
Where do I see like how many enemies I've killed for the for the dash? It's probably near my health bar. Oh, hello. I get it. You want me to kill enemies with a power dash? <laughs> come back with another creature. So it's kind of funny because I've been getting achievements for like killing five enemies, killing three enemies. I would have assumed that killing five enemies would have given me the achievement for killing three and four, but it, did, it didn't. <laughs> you have to do it individually. Can I... No. I can set that on fire, just not with what I have now. See? Now I have the one for killing four enemies. Oh, I got all the hearts. Oh, I see where the, uh, the dash thing is. have been exercising. Nice of you to notice. So can I do it upward? Yes, you can. So this game seems to be all about this dash move. Like, yeah, I can shoot projectiles, but it really, really wants me to use this dash move. Is it worth surrendering to save those that are already damned? Those that are less deserving than you? Wait, how did I get here? The entire ordeal felt like a nightmare, I believe it so. Were it not for this strange fruit I found within Brom's mind. What is it? Perhaps Master Ulrich will know more. For my work is not done yet. Master Ulrich mentioned more drunken revelers around the chapel grounds. Donate gold to the Madonna statue and gain valuable upgrades. Performing power dash kills and maximize your loot. Make sure you power dash as often as possible. Add a fourth projectile. Add another heart. Add another heart. Alright. Apparently I didn't I didn't get enough gold. Ah, 
All right. Defeat enemies with their power. Yeah. Again. Really wants to hammer home the whole power dash thing. Come on, where's the power dash? Oh, hello. I mean, I could kill four things. Okay, there. Now I can power dash. So let me go back. See if I can gather up all those, uh, all those fish. Come on. Uh, I wanted to get him too, but all right. like inside me okay I got that okay Oh my god, game, will you stop telling me about the power dash? I know about the power dash. I have been using the power dash. Insta-death? Is it really insta-death? Hold up. Oh, okay. I need some kind of other beast that can go down there. Can I just farm these guys then? Just keep hitting try again and... Yeah. Oh, damn it. Uh. Can't shoot the projectiles. Up in there, I don't need those hearts yet. So I'll come back for them. Ow! Look now. Okay. 
What? Only two? Looks like it takes three, three shots. Wait, can you not go up and right? Oh, you can't. Light those braziers on fire yet? Okay, there's three enemies, and there's the fourth. here. Oh, come on. The table got in the way. And that's, like, not the first time that the table has gotten in the way. I don't know. It's just... It's annoying that that table blocks you when you do your dash. Twins neglectful parenting more abhorrent than the divine father's disregard for his children. What dutiful father idly watches his creation suffer and does nothing to intervene? I'm not sure I'll ever get used to it. Does this ever change? Hmm. Maybe it does, maybe it doesn't. All right. So let's upgrade our heart container. Because I don't think we need a fourth projectile just yet. There's someone in the confessional. It's been long since I last took confession. Forgive me, Father. For I am sinned. I set eyes on a sinner behind the bush in the chapel's courtyard, and I fear I judged him harshly. It is not our place to judge, friend. I know. Still, how else will the sinner's soul be saved? We will all be judged eventually, but not all will be saved. Repent. And I can absolve you of your... He left? At least I know where to... Hmm. Well, that was suspicious. Is it this boy? I remember when David was born. He's still but a boy. Yes, David's soul is pure. You need not enter his mind. He is sinless, but if you do enter, you may find it will end. Yeah! Ooh. 
Enter and exit innocent minds as often as you like, since you may not yet be able to unravel all of their mysteries. Yep, I can't set this on fire, so... Oh, okay. One, two, three. I see. Probably... Okay, so it's probably one, two, three, four, five, six. It's just you can't see them all. This kid's got a really messed up mind. mind no gluttony boss hogsimus or hogissimus Well, there was no way to dash onto him. Oh, hey, a new fragment. How long would you battle? If you knew victory could never be achieved, sin can never truly be eradicated. Humanity was born in sin, and to sin it shall return. This constant to and fro between dreaming and waking, it's hard to know what is real, but I believe that's all the sinners I can find. I should see Master Ulrich. Yeah, I don't quite have enough, but who knows? I might have something for the next, uh... Oh my. Well, that was... Heaven, what's that? I prefer it when dreams only come to me in my sleep. That was... <laughs> a little unnerving. Master Ulrich. I found the sinners around the chapel. They are cleansed of sin. Good. You have done well, Cecile. Did you find any artifacts in their minds? Artifacts? I did. This fruit. They appear to be symbolic, but their purpose eludes me. Ah, the fruit. Come from the garden itself. They are the forbidden fruit. From the tree of knowledge of good and evil. It cannot be. How did they end up in the minds of sinners? The first forbidden fruit was the means the devil used to tempt humanity. It only took a bite to birth original sin, leading to humanity's fall and expulsion from the garden. But there was more fruit on the tree of knowledge that mysteriously went missing. It was rumored. Devil stole them for his own end. 
Now we know Sinwell too has been led to temptation. The devil himself has corrupted the people of Sinwell? I think that is now a bygone conclusion. We must find the remaining forbidden fruit and destroy them. Only then can we stop the devil from driving Sinwell deeper into sin. But before we continue, Cecile, how are you faring? I cannot say yet. I know my purpose, but I fear doubt has crawled into my thoughts. It is more than understandable. You are exhausted. First, I believe you have recovered another glass fragment to restore an additional window. Do so, and then rest. There is much still to do. Okay. Let's repair this window, see what we get. Ooh, is that a gargoyle? And it has fire breath, short range, very effective against flying enemies. Uh, certain objects such as boxes or braziers can be set on fire. You can now swap with R uh, L1 and R1. Okay. A gargoyle. Is it necessary I bring this horror into the minds of these sinners? Is there no other way to lead them to the light? to drown them in such darkness why must demons adorn the windows of a quaint little chapel of all the beauty that lies in creation between heaven and earth why depict hell's abomination well this is quite an interesting game uh i think i'm gonna stop here so i don't reveal too much about the game um there are more souls to save i should best get to it my eye caught some familiar faces idling by the marketplace the festival may be hmm. long over but honest work has yet to return but yeah, this is this is quite an interesting game. Um, it's a little action platformer, uh, short little levels, uh, but you know, interesting boss fights, uh, an upgradable set of abilities. What is this? Upgrade the gargoyle's fire breath. Add a fourth, add a fifth projectile. Uh, I don't have enough money for any of that. Um, but. It does look like this tree is going to get bigger and bigger with the more abilities that you get access to. Yeah, this uh, this could be quite an interesting game. I have a feeling that you are actually doing the handiwork of some evil force. But maybe not. You know, it's hard to say right now. Um, but yeah, this uh, this is a uh, an interesting game. Saga of Sins for the PlayStation 5. Um, I've been the Blue Fox. Thank you very much, everyone. Have a wonderful day.